Hi everybody, Ravensky23 here with my first video and uh, this is really annoying because trying to find a place where the light actually worked, which I'm not so sure it does, I'm kind of looking green to me, um, and also this annoying red light blinking at me, I don't know how you people do this, but we're going to give it a shot because um, that's the only way that I can introduce myself to you other than a few comments and so let's get to it okay um, I live in Connecticut I used to live in Iowa because that's where I was born and I've also lived in Kansas City Missouri and Chicago for quite a number of years um, <clears throat> I got here Connecticut which I never thought I was going to be in Connecticut I always thought I would end up in the Pacific Northwest but um, plans be as they are. I met my husband, Timber Geek, on YouTube. I met him in an internet chat room back in 95. Yes, kids, there was an internet in 95. And um, it was totally not planned. Neither of us were looking for anybody else. And in fact, I was married at the time. I was getting a divorce at the time. And so it didn't go anywhere right away. But um, we were definitely attracted to each other and after about a year and a half we finally met I flew out here and um, at that point we knew that we wanted to be together well long story short I moved out here and I've been here now for 12 years I think if that math's right and we've been married for 10 years so it seems to be working we're happy anyway <clears throat> we have I'm sorry, it's also 6.30 in the morning, so I don't know what I'm doing 6.30 in the morning. This is crazy. I'm not a morning person at all. Uh, I work at a bank. I'm a assistant branch manager at a bank, which is what, like it says on my um, page, my YouTube page, that's what sustains me, not what fulfills me. What I really love to do is I'm uh, a fiber artist, I'm a knitter, I'm a spinner, and I, I have two spinning wheels, three, um, and also I like to weave, and I'm just learning that basically. Um, but I have one, two, three, four looms. I know it's insane. Anyway, <clears throat> and I have more wool and fiber and yarn than any normal person of any sane person should have. Okay. I also have, from previous marriage, I have a 32-year-old daughter, and I have a granddaughter who is just the light of my life. I have a picture of her here on my computer, but you'll see more of her later. I don't know if that even came out. Anyway, I just wanted to say hi to everybody. I've been on YouTube now for about, I don't know, over a year, but... I mean, I, I first came on YouTube because I think I looked at the skateboarding dog or it might have been the guys on the treadmill, you know, doing the dance on the treadmill. One of those ridiculous things. That's what I thought YouTube was all about. And then I found Zipster08 and I went, who in the hell is this guy? Um, and I was immediately sucked in because he's such a wonderful person and I started watching his general circle of friends and he, people he recommended and I'm like oh my god there's all these people on YouTube that are just fantastic so consequently now I've just got tons of subscribers people I subscribe to tons of subscribers yeah but I do have some subscribers as of yesterday I, and I even looked this morning I have five subscribers and I didn't even have a video I love you guys that was great thank you very much um, it made me feel very good and like it said on Nut Cheese's video yesterday, I think I'm addicted now. But <clears throat> I promise I won't be crazy or anything. Well, no, I don't promise that. Anyway, um, this is it. This is my first video and I was going to talk about our trip to Quebec, which we did last weekend. Um, Timber, Geek, Timber Geek, my husband, uh, and I went up to Quebec, to Montebello, Quebec, um, to Le Chateau de Montebello, something like that. And it was a beautiful place. It's this fantastic resort that's made of, it was made of 10,000 cedar logs back in 1930 by 5,000 guys in 120 days. Can't even imagine it. It's phenomenal. It has a, in the center of it has an atrium with a three-story 
stone fireplace, six-sided fireplace. It was just phenomenal. But anyway, we went to the Timber Framers Guild Eastern Conference, uh, the 23rd Eastern Conference. We've attended the last three, four, something like that. But they're really fun. A lot of great people. We love these guys. They're, there's, you know, like 450 people attend. And uh, it was fun. Anyway, so I'm off for my day at work. I got to leave in about 15 minutes, so this is going to have to be the end. But um, thanks for watching, if you're watching. If nobody's watching, then I guess I'm not thanking you. Um, anyway, I have no idea how to run this camera, so if this worked, fantastic. If it didn't work, um, I'll try again. But um, Timber Geek is the one who is actually, that's the geek part of the, the timber is the timber framing. The, he's building our house. That's another whole story. And we will be showing you lots of videos of our house. We've been building this house for like two and a half years now. He cut the frame from trees on our property. Uh, it's post and beam frame, you know. Well, you'll see. Okay. But anyway, um, so that's more to come some fantastic stuff like that but we're just starting out we're learning this camera we have no we have no manual for this camera it, we bought it brand new it's a Canon power shot something I can't see because there's a red blinking light right over what it is it's a s2 something anyway uh, and he's the one that actually is the one that can figure this thing out I don't even know the fact that the red button is flashing I guess is a good sign but it's also really annoying and I want to tell you guys I really appreciate all the effort you do to make these fantastic videos that I love to watch and uh, that's it so have a great day and I'll talk to you guys later thanks bye